In our work detecting, analyzing, monitoring, and intervening in private homeschool legislation in California, which we've been doing since 1986, uh, there's a lot of work that we do behind the scenes as well as testifying in committees, uh, working out uh, amendment language with legislators and their staff, um, working on organizing um, opposition when a bill is, seems to be moving through the legislature and activating many people to make phone calls and write letters. But there's some things that we can't do and one of those things is by letting legislators see real homeschool families up close, getting them to, to understand that these are, are normal people, that they're having a positive impact on our society. And that's something that, that I can't do by myself. Um, we at FPM need you all to help us to do that. It's something that you can really make a difference in helping us to do by participating either in a district office visit with visiting your legislator at the local level or uh, participating with us in Capital Day. Now, what is Capital Day? Capital Day is when privately homeschooling families are invited to join us as we visit our state legislators in order to create a visible presence and positive impression of private home education in California. Um, training is provided and is required for all participants. Uh, but in addition to training, you'll hear inspiring messages from those who work with the legislature at the Capitol as well as legislators themselves. Um, we also have tours uh, of the Capitol building that are available if you're interested in learning more about uh, not just the legislative process, but the, the history of the legislative process and the building itself. What happens at Capitol Day? That um, is something that changes a little bit from one year to the next, but we have special speakers um, with insights on the inner workings of the state capitol and how the legislative process works, the importance of your involvement in that process. Uh, we have training sessions that um, you can learn about uh, the impact that you can have on legislators and their staff uh, prior to the actual visits. Um, then we, we send folks out in groups with lots of information on homeschooling, um, now trained folks ready to uh, visit with legislators and their staff. They have meetings with legislators and staff about homeschooling, get to answer questions um, or refer them to other resources for getting answers to their questions on homeschooling. But it really gives the legislators a chance to put a face with homeschooling. And um, it's great to have uh, young people involved because the legislators really love to, to see young people involved in government and interested in that. Um, in addition to that, you can have a, a private tour of the Capitol building, as I, as I mentioned. Um, this, the purpose of Capitol Day, in addition to, to what I just mentioned of putting a face to homeschooling, is it, it informs the, the newly elected and newer legislators and newer staff, which they're there are a lot of new staff every year um, about how homeschooling works in California. It reminds veteran legislators of the benefits of private homeschooling. It, it strengthens our working relationships with various legislators and their staff on a professional level. And it leaves them with a, a way to contact us if they ever have any questions about home education. I know some legislative staff that have kept our homeschool information packets from Capital Day uh, for many years, and they have made those phone calls many times about, uh, what about this issue? Um, we have some questions about this. Can you help us get these answered? Sometimes it's a constituent that calls them and asks, how do we homeschool? And we can you know, send them information about who they should contact in their area or um, how to get started, but also when they have legislative questions. Can we work together on such and such bill so that you guys are happy with the outcome of this bill? That is always very helpful to get those calls before a bill is introduced or before it's going to committee so that we can work uh, together with an office instead of come into the scene and have to be opposing a bill or um, have, have a negative um, interaction with a legislative office. It's so much better if, if they have information about who we are first and they can contact us when they have something that they think would be either of a concern to us or something that they think might might help us, which it may or may not ultimately, but we can at least we can work together on it. So 
I would encourage you to participate in Capital Day for the, the practical reasons of how you can make a difference to help further the, the fight for freedom for private homeschooling in California.